Hello, my name is Ruth Carter and I'm a licensed attorney in Arizona and this is your question of the day. So somebody asked me what happens if someone in a foreign country threatens to post your intimate photos online? Okay, so we're talking about a situation, let's say you're in the US and the other person is in England, Japan, Australia, Malaysia, South Africa, somewhere else, and they're saying, and they're saying, I'm going to post them online. Um, that's it's a little bit challenging because you may live somewhere that has a revenge porn law, but they may not have the ability to go after that person because it's a foreign country. Um, you're, even if you could, chances of them, you know, if you wanted to sue them and then you have to get them served and that's challenging when you're going over country lines. Not impossible, challenging. Um, if you happen to know exactly where they live, you could report it to their local law enforcement. I don't know how seriously they'll take you if you're like, hi, Paris, France, I'm calling from Dallas, Texas. I want to make a report. They may or may not take you seriously, um, and it may not be illegal um, where that other person lives. If they actually do post it online, depending on where they post it, you can file a report um, claiming that it's unauthorized, report the image, etc. And so you could get it removed. You can always do a reverse Google image search to see if it's been posted. Um, but in terms of controlling this person's behavior, that's hard. Uh, and it's really hard when we're talking about things that are happening over country lines. So. Yeah, I get this. I get these types of questions a lot um, from even from kids, and it's challenging because there's not a lot you can do when the other side is on is in a different country. So um, even if you have the law on your side, enforcing it against that person is challenging. I'm hoping this person is just making a threat and they're not going to follow through with it. Um, but I hope you're never in this type of situation ever again. So yeah, I hope this has been somewhat helpful. I wish I could give a more concrete answer, but these, these situations are always very gray versus black and white. So um, as always, watching this video does not create an attorney-client relationship with any viewer. It's merely legal information, not legal advice. If you need legal advice, go hire somebody. I put out new content every week, so please subscribe to the channel, and until then, I will catch up with you later. Take care.